So they brought us the bread and this is for the soup. We're here in Peru, mostly the soup we eat it with canchita and I put a lot of cebollita china. And some people like to put the lemon. I personally, I don't like it because I think that they destroy the flavor of the soup. And here they also give you bread. I think with every soup, they gave us the best location, I think. Today Yuya will leave to Japan, but he will come back in 20 days more or less. He's coming! Ay, que guapo! Gracias. Cheers. Here everybody is very kind. So this is mine. This one doesn't have any meat and this is real. As he said that he will miss Lomo Saltao, he ordered it now. We are in the plaza now to buy the snacks for my family and my last dinner before I leave Peru for Lomo Saltao. So, it's aquí más mi amor. Be honest. The meat is very soft. They grill this meat as a steak, then they cut it and they put it. As I taste the smokiness, it's very delicious. But the uh, almost avocado that I always have it has a little bit of vinegar, I think. Uh -huh. But this one don't have any vinegar, not sour at all. It's a moon. Okay, let's try this. What did you order? A spaghetti with fungi, I think. Yeah, that's fungi, mushroom. Uh huh, mushroom. Okay, I will eat it. I think if they put a little bit more of cream. This will be perfect. It'll be more of salty. Uh huh. Here the main is the soup. Not the soup is but you know, I like the one that we can buy on the street. Here the soup is not too thick, but the one that you buy it on the street sometimes mm. it's very thick. And some they put like a lot of garlic, which I like it. This one don't taste too much garlic. It's good to you know go out with your girlfriend or somebody who you like go on a date and drink this one because you don't have a garlic. Mm. Right? Light of garlic in my soup. ¿Qué te vas a Japón? ¿Estás feliz? Hola, ¿qué haces? Sí, bien. Voy a estar aquí, si algo pasa, ¿ok? Estamos aquí, como amigos. Hey guys, I just finished taking a shower and finished eating and I'm so tired and exhausted. Well, from Lima to America, it was like six hours and then from America, Houston to Japan was 14 hours, so it's uh, 20 hours. Yeah. From the airport in Tokyo, I took a bus and rode for two hours to come to my hometown. So it's like more than 24 hours in total that I used to come back to my hometown. So day one in Japan, this is all. I'm gonna sleep, I'm so exhausted. Anyways, this is all for us today. Thanks for watching my video. If you like my video, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video. Entonces, ciao!